Coach, talk about the ABCD camp, though. You know, you just mentioned it. That's a legendary camp. And we, oh, yeah. I was just watching a documentary with LeBron James and, yeah. um, and uh, talking about, like, his career. And that camp really propelled his, you know, startup, right. his jump. You know, even having p- players like Kobe Bryant walk through those doors. I never realized it until I saw the, the retro throwback pics that you posted. Yeah. You know, what did you know from, uh, about that? Well, it's funny. The, the first ABCD camp was really at Princeton. And mm-hmm. then it evolved and came to Fairleigh Dickinson University. Uh, and I was at the game that LeBron made, became the king. And, and it was right on the court. If you come to our practice in the main court, the, the, the basket closest to the entrance but going sideways, that's where the game was played. And uh, LeBron played against Lenny. Oh, my God. I'm drawing a blank on his last name, but he was a tremendous player from here in the metropolitan area. I'll I'll think of it as we go on. Um, And everybody was in the building. I mean, every person from – uh, New York City, the media, national media, every college coach that every everyone wanted LeBron at that time, they knew about him, but um, they were down a point, and it was under 30 seconds, and then LeBron just started rocking the ball at the top of the key, took him off the bounce, stepped back, and made the shot that that made LeBron, like, that night it was made and it was made right in, in, in the Rothman center at Fairleigh Dickinson. So that's where all the players came through, you know, and prior to that, it was five-star basketball camp, mm. which was run by Howard Garfinkel and Will Klein. And I, I played at that. I was on uh, Dominique Wilkins's team in camp. And uh, so man, basketball is just a part of my history and it's, and, and it's incredible how I come back to Fairleigh Dickinson and it, it comes to fruition because I I went all over this country and all over this world uh, chasing my dream. My dream was nine miles from my house, you know, so it's...